Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Hassan and today we will work on gravity form and we will create multiple columns in our form through plugin. Before starting work, it's my request. Please subscribe my channel. Thank you. Now back to our work. So now first we will install plugin. So go to plugins and click on add new. And then in search plugins, write multiple columns for gravity form. So this is plugin multiple column for gravity form. So click on install now. And then click on activate. So plugin is activated. So now go to gravity form and we will create form there. So click on gravity forms. And then click on add new. So we will create new form. So multiple columns you can write your form title and description and then click on create form so this is our form id so first this is our uh, short code for gravity form and replace id here with 5 so our form id is 5 so here 5 title fall if you want to show title then write here true and also description so click on update now creating form now so first on right side you see standard fields advanced field post fields pricing fields and then multiple column fields when click on it then you see row start row end and column break so first drag row start so row start is added so here you see and then add some field add name field and in drag and drop here then you can set according to your requirement i only want first name or you can set here you see first so you can set name just so now you see name and field label so now break the column so column break and now edit another field so this is row start column 1 and break column and now column 2 so again multi advanced field and add date here you will create form according to your requirement and then go to row end so row end this is row start then first column then column break and column 2 and then row end so click on update so form is updated now refresh, uh, go to page so now you see name and date in two columns so in this way you can create multiple columns like column break you can add again column break here and add any field here now you see row start row end and then name in first column date in second column and time in third column so you can create multiple column through this plugin i hope you like this video please like comment share subscribe thank you for watching